So as you can see here, the new series Dalek looks pretty damn good next to the 13th Doctor. Hello and welcome to another Doctor Who mini review. In today's review we are taking a closer look at the 13th Doctor 5.5 inch action figure. Now I know this is a very unusual thing here on my channel for me to be reviewing a new series figure but I wanted to do this review for two reasons. One, of course, Doctor Who is coming back on our screens on January the 1st, 2020. So this gets us ready in preparation for that series. And the second reason, there is a massive sale happening right now on this figure on Forbidden Planet's website. So if you're interested in buying this figure then please use the link down below in the description of this video and that will take you directly to Forbidden Planet and it will take you directly to the page where you can purchase this figure for £8.99. It will really help me out and this channel out if you are able to use that link when you purchase this item. So let's now take a closer look at the back of the packaging. As you can see, it shows other items that are available in stores now. That includes the 10 inch doll action figure and also the 13th Doctor's electronic sonic screwdriver. One of which I've actually got, I've got the 10 inch doll. And if you'd like me to review that, then let me know in the comments down below. Now, if we take a look at the front of the packaging, I quite like the packaging style here because it's a lot smaller than we're used to, so it doesn't take up much room when you're displaying these in their box. But I will be opening this particular figure in today's video. So, with that being said, let's take a closer look at the action figure itself. Okay, so we have the figure out of the packaging, and as you can see, the likeness to Jodie Whittaker is actually really, really good. This is the first time I've had a 5.5 inch range version of the 13th Doctor Jodie Whittaker, and I must say, having it in hand, I really, really like it. There's a lot of detail here and a lot of things to talk about. First of all, like many other Doctors, the Doctor comes with her sonic screwdriver. And there it is. And the detailing on the sonic screwdriver is actually really good considering the size of the sonic screwdriver. It's even got the little yellow bits at the front there. Now let's have a look at the articulation of this figure. The arms rotate 360. There's articulation in the wrist and the hand. The elbow has articulation there as well. Having a look at the articulation of the head, it does do a 360. I don't know why you'd ever want to do that, but it does work. And the leg articulation is as follows. There is a bend at the knee, and let's see if the ankles twist. Okay, the ankles don't twist, so there's just the articulation there, and also at the hip. The 13th Doctor has a lovely coat on, and inside the coat is a nice navy blue, with the stripes that just go up there going into her jumper there with the braces and the colourful little pattern there. So I actually like the outfit that the 13th Doctor wears and it'll be interesting to see if she wears this in her new series, The Airs, in 2020. As you can see here, the new series Dalek looks pretty damn good next to the 13th Doctor. So my overall thoughts and feelings on this Doctor Who figure is it actually is really, really good. Having it in hand, I'm definitely glad I got it. And I'm definitely glad I got it at the sale price, which was obviously advertised on Forbidden Planet's website. As I mentioned in the beginning of this video, please click on that link and it will take you straight to the page where you can buy this for only £8.99. So thanks for watching and I will see you all again very soon in another Doctor Who review.